In example two, we want to determine whether the dilation from the blue figure to the red figure is an enlargement or reduction. And then we want to determine the scale factor of, of the dilation. Try this on your own first. In this first picture, we have this blue triangle and the big red triangle to the right. In the second figure, we have the big blue quadrilateral and the small red quadrilateral inside. Figure it out on your own first. So we want to know if going from blue to red is an enlargement or a reduction. And we want to know by what scale factor. Pause the video and resume when you're ready to see the solution. For this first one, hopefully you do see that going from blue to red is an enlargement. Now to figure out the scale factor, what you want to do is you want to find one ordered pair. For example, A is at 2 comma 0. The corresponding vertex D is at 8 comma 0. We multiplied by 4, so our scale factor, the scale of factor of dilation, is K equals 4. For problem 2, we see that going from the blue to the red is a reduction. And then we do want to pick two ordered pairs. We can choose, I'll write reduction down here actually, because I'm going to look at this ordered pair here that's at 6 comma 0, and this ordered pair here that is at 2 comma 0. To go from the pair on the blue to the ordered pair on the red, we're dividing by 3, or we can say that we multiply by 1 third. Thus, our scale factor of dilation is 1 third. This brings us to the homework problems. In the picture below, the black triangle is your original figure. I want you to determine whether the transformations displayed below are a dilation, reflection, rotation, or translation. You're given the black figure as the original, so tell me if the blue is a dilation, reflection, rotation, or translation. Same thing with green, purple, and red.